Hello internet people, this is Meteor Bolt, and uh, I am about to strike with uh, a Let's Play video on Metroid Dread, which just unlocked right now. Here we have a very ominous title card with some smoke. Almost like it's a horror game. Adjust brightness. Plus the brightness of the image on the left is barely visible. Barely visible. We're gonna go a lot darker then. Okay. Looks like it's good right there. Yes. File one. And here we go. That's, I think, a Metroid. Metroid, a virulent floating organism that drained energy from its prey through physical contact. Metroids were originally created by the Chozo and named after their word for ultimate warrior. Their value as a bioweapon sparked several crises and as a result, all traces of them have been eliminated. They are now extinct. Very exciting music for something so ominous. Exparasite, a gelatinous parasitic organism indigenous to the planet SR388. It would absorb the DNA of its host, living or dead, and replicate its form. When infecting a living host, it could even access the host's memories. Exparasites were driven not by emotion, but by an instinctive need to replicate and spread to increasingly stronger hosts. Their inability to be controlled marked them as even more dangerous than their sole predator, the Metroids. Like the Metroids, they are believed extinct. More dangerous than the Metroids. And that's Samus fighting some ex-parasite, apparently. And one of them hit her. I should say, I really, I really don't know much about the Metroid story. And there she is being taken over by it. With no Metroid surviving on SR388, it became infested with the X, horrifying parasites capable of imitating any living being. They just told us what it was. That's kind of redundant. Unaware of this, I set foot on the planet, got infected, and almost died. I guess this must be Samus talking. And that's a syringe. The only thing that saved me was a vaccine created from Metroid DNA, which also left me uniquely able to oppose the X. This ability was tested immediately when I went to a Biological Space Laboratories BSL, research station to investigate a distress signal. And that looks like some kind of black hole or a portal. There I battled many powerful X forms, including the SAX, which was the X mimicking me in my power suit at full strength. I believe otherwise known as Dark Samus. I eventually eliminated the X Menace on SR388 by battling the BSL research station on a collision course with the planet. Oh, by setting the BSL research station on a collision course with the planet. Yeah, that makes more sense. After that, the X and Metroids were just memories. Or so we thought. Just when it all seemed over, the Galactic Federation received a mysterious video transmission. Yeah, that looks like a very large parasite float floating around. It showed an X, alive and in the wild. Thorough analysis proved the video was real. Although the sender was unknown, the transmission was traced to a particular planet. Is that like a monster hanging onto the side of a moon? What is... It was called ZDR. 
If the X had somehow escaped extinction out there, they would pose a threat to the entire galaxy. The Galactic Federation dispatched a research team of seven EMMI to investigate. Excellian Star Corporation. That doesn't sound ominous at all. An M er, <clears throat> EMMI is a large research robot designed to capture field samples and extract their DNA. Capture field samples, okay. Their incredible mobility and protective plating, made of the strongest stuff in the universe, practically guarantee the mission's success. Funny they don't say exactly what it was made of, it's just the strongest stuff. But not, lo not long after their arrival on ZDR, all communication was lost. I'm guessing the X-Parasite took over the EMMI. What is happening on ZDR? Is the planet really infested with X? As the only one immune to the parasites, it's up to me to go there and find out. Okay. So, I'm a bounty hunter. But apparently, the reason I'm going here is because I'm the only one who can take it on. So, I'm like an altruistic bounty, bounty hunter. Hmm, that must be planet ZDR. Atmosphere. Thank you, computer. The bounty for this mission does not seem appropriate. Uh, thank you, computer. The risk clearly outweighs the reward. But I'm altruistic, remember? I'm doing this for the good of... Humanity? And my computer calls me Lady. The atmosphere on this planet looks interesting. I almost thought it was like a crooked ring, but I think that blue cloudy thing was the atmosphere. And I guess I must have been thrown out of my ship or something? Apparently not. I'm determined to do this no matter the risk. Wow, she is a quick draw expert. Wow, I did not expect to encounter a crazy bug emperor. Guess it has a pretty good shield. One day this will be what real live gaming footage looks like and not a cutscene. Ooh. Maybe 
it recognizes me. It's going to have mercy on me. Something's weird about my hand, apparently. Okay, finally I'm in control now. Okay, I can run back and forth. I can jump with the B button. Y button shoots in any direction I want. And if I press left on the directional pad, I pull up that little mini map. Cool. I can probably shoot this door open. Maybe I need missiles. Do I have missiles? Ooh, I can climb walls. Or hang from ledges, anyway. Uh, okay. So I can hit... I can do, like, a melee attack with X. That's cool. Can I do that in midair? Yeah. And I can fire in midair. Right joystick doesn't seem to do anything. Um, oh, R just did something. I think I just switched to a different gun. Hmm. I, guess, I guess if I hold R down and then press Y, I can shoot missiles. That's it. That door doesn't seem to be wanting to open for missiles, so I guess I'll go this way. And the map fills in any area, any area that I'm in. Huh. Just like in Super Metroid. I did play Super Metroid for a little bit, so I know the kind of thing that happens in this sort of game. Ooh, that looks, looks like I need to shoot it in the back. Okay, cool. Oh. More of them. It seems to speed up when I start shooting it. Wonder if those background bird things are going to do anything. While tilting L to run, press ZL to slide. Ah, oh, okay. Hold L to use free aim mode. Right, so I can aim without moving. And I can hang from ledges. Okay, cool. And I can hang from that ledge while free aiming and hang from this edge and hang from that edge. That's cool. Ooh, what is this? He, lo he looks a little bit like the crazy bug emperor. Ammo already at maximum capacity. Oh, my ammo refilled somehow. Let's see, I don't appear to be able to go in there yet. Hold R to ready missiles and press Y to fire. Some blocks can be destroyed only by using specific weapons. Oh, and it has a little missile symbol on it. <laughs> can slide. Some destructible blocks are hidden. If you run into a dead end, try shooting at your surroundings. Striking some blocks with missiles may reveal how to destroy them. Okay. I didn't need to strike it with a missile, but that's... that worked. Oh. Alright. Uh, oh, that seems dangerous. Oh, those must be missiles I've been picking up from the enemies. I was wondering what those red things were. Okay, some kind of apparatus. I'm gonna stick my arm in it, I think. Because that... seems like a safe thing to do. I'm gonna talk... Well done, Samus. I have reviewed your 
vital signs and video log from the data you uploaded. Okay, my computer is called Adam. I brought That's a cool. analysis, but I cannot account for why you lost consciousness. My readings indicate dramatic physical changes in you. Ooh, that's, um, Whatever concerning. Whatever caused these changes seems to have stripped you of most abilities. You might call it physical amnesia. <laughs> you might call it, uh, what the plot needed to that happen. brings me to your assailant. I am checking the Federation database against your video log. It appears to have been a chozo. The attacker's identity is not yet clear. I have determined that you are somewhere within the depths of ZDR. Your top priority should be to return to your ship on the surface. This situation is precarious. Trust your instincts as you navigate upward. Navigate upward? That's different than Super Metroid. This planet appears to consist of multiple areas. Shuttles, elevators, and other modes of transport connect them. Keep an eye out for ways to reach the surface. The ship's okay. location is marked on your global map. Check it for yourself. You may encounter pockets of low temperature. Your Metroid DNA renders you vulnerable to such environments. Spending time in cold areas will be harmful to you. Oh, so I guess I have to move through those there areas are many quickly. such cold areas scattered underground. Do not enter them with your basic power suit. Oh, I guess I can't enter them. Thing. Underground interference is preventing radio transmissions. Check in with me at any network stations you find. Roger, Adam. Sure. I wonder if Adam has a backstory. Press, uh, plus to open the map. Press m minus to open the options. Okay, let's look at the options. Brightness, rumble on, amiibo, system. What does system mean? Save. Oh, loading checkpoints. Take a look at the controls to see if there's anything I missed. Options, move, expand mini map, slide, free aim, missile mode, shoot, jump, dash melee. Okay, yeah, melee counter. Okay, I think I got it. Plus, and ammo recharge station. Samus. Okay, I can look at my status. Nothing really to see there. Mission log. Uh, said I was supposed to look for my ship, but I don't see anything here that would tell me where my ship is. So. Guess I'll just go this way. It almost seems cruel to shoot those blob things, because they don't seem very dangerous. They do give me energy, or whatever that is, so... I don't think that's a missile door. I'm gonna check anyway and hit it with five missiles. Okay. I'm gonna go this way. Oh! Cutscene! That was a quick transition to cutscene. Oh. Use a melee counter at the right moment to parry certain actions and automatically take aim at the attacker. Press X to use your melee counter now. Okay. Okay. I was too early that second time. Parry enemy attacks with the melee counter by pressing X at the right moment. Okay. Interesting. I gotta learn their attack patterns. Oh! I bet I can counter that bat, too. Being an enemy... En wow, those bats are... They have some range. Defeating an enemy that has been stunned as the result of a counter will cause it to drop more items. Okay, so incentive to counter things when I can. Pretty much always, I guess.
Okay, cool. Not too difficult to counter those bats. But yeah, of course the uh, plot had to strip me of most of my abilities. I don't, I don't think any, at least I don't think Metroid or Super Metroid ever explained why you had to start from scratch. Alright, come on. Oh, I see what it means by automatically target the enemy. Target it with your gun so that you can just press Y after you counter it. I wonder if I... I don't think I can get up there yet. This seems like a door or something. Let's see, let's hit it with a missile. Okay. Artaria. If an area on the map is blinking, it indicates that a hidden item is there. Oh, the whole area will blink. That's cool. Okay, so there's an, a hidden item here. Move cursor, zoom in and out, reset position, fast cursor. Okay, zooming in and out. All right. I can zoom way in and way out. That's cool. All right, so there's a hidden item here. Maybe it's this thing? Yep, that's it. Missile tank acquired. Missile capacity increased by two. Lovely. Oh, and there's a door. Awesome. Oh, and I fell in a hole. Great. So much for trying the other door. I think it's one of those MA award winning robots. Don't know why I'm just staring at it. Uh. Oh, slide under it. Okay. Huh. Doesn't seem to be able to climb very easily. Does the game want me to go over here and try to shoot it? Oh no! Oh, I pressed, I pressed the wrong, I pressed the wrong button for free aiming. Okay, that was not what I meant to do. You have one chance to escape when captured by an EMMI. Okay. Oh, now let's try the other door. Oh, we can't. Great. All right, we're gonna do this the right way now. This one, you know what? This one's really slow because it's damaged. They're really putting on the kid gloves for this first encounter. Okay, now I'm going up here, and I'm going to press L to free aim. Hmm.
Okay, that was stupid. All right, I'm just gonna run away this time. Can I skip the cutscene? Yeah. Okay, more cutscene. Cool. Ooh. That might be dangerous, or it might not be. Ooh, it looks like a, a brain. It's gonna give me a new power, I think. The energy from the central unit transformed the arm cannon into an omega cannon. Omega Blaster Online. Hold L to use aim mode. Tilt L to aim. If a target is nearby, Samus will automatically face that direction. Hold R to charge the Omega Blaster. Once charged, press Y while still holding R to fire. Aim at the core. Aim mode. Interesting, so that's not, I don't have a regular free aim anymore. Hold L to use aim mode till, right. Okay, so. I guess that's not what I was supposed to try. Telling me to aim at the core again. I don't know what the core is in this in this case. Okay, I aim at its head. Got it. Oh. Omega Cannon depleted and offline, reverting to regular arm cannon. Interesting. So that's like a... contextual... plot element that appears whenever I... need the ability to fight one of those robots. Oh! Uh, door seam did not work. be, be working right. Oh, that area is glowing, so it means there's something hidden in there. Can I not get back there, though? Oh, I mean, plus. Yeah, so I don't think I can get back up there from this door. Items 3%. Oh, from this region? Alright, let's go back in this door to see if we can get up there. I don't think we can. I don't see how. Alright, we'll come back later. Now 
Now we'll try this door. Ooh, is this going to give me a new power that's maybe permanent? Save your progress. Accept. Alright, that's about a half hour, so I'm going to conclude this video. Thank you for watching. I will be immediately recording another episode of this, so chances are by the time you see this, this video, episode 2 will be available. But anyway, thank you for watching. Please give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, uh, share this on social media, leave a comment, etc. Meteor Bolt has struck.